All right, friends, welcome to beautiful Escondido. <laughs> well, hey, it's Carlos G, just giving you another live video here. It is another beautiful day. It is out in Escondido right now, and it is warm. Definitely coming from the coast, coming out to Escondido. It only took 20 minutes. Nevertheless, it's in the 90s already. Huh? Summertime. It's about time. So it's Carlos G, and I'm here at one of my newest solds happening here. Probably in about uh, one hour, we'll get the confirmation that this closed. Um, this is a property that was an expired listing here, and this couple moved already up to Seattle. He was a police officer, and she was... Um, in business and they made a move up to Seattle for a better life. So this is a big 10,000 square foot lot. It's a big four bedroom, three bath house. It has a pool in the back and this property was expired. I called them to see if I could help them. I shared with them my plan. They thought about it and then basically they said, let's get it going. So we had stagers. We had Carol Kaplan and Danny come in. We staged it beautifully. We did light staging. It was all the entry, the kitchen, and then also we did the, um, the the living room so it's always you know that first curb appeal that you need I know outside needs a little bit more love nevertheless it's clean that's the thing so you can see here that uh, they got a big backyard here and then goes up into a pool area and uh, should be closed yep definitely a nice pool So the thing is, is getting the property prepared and then coming in and having Paul, our professional photographer, come in and do some amazing photos. Uh, we didn't do any aerial drone on this, but we have aerial drone going on two more listings tomorrow. But it's really best to get the property cleaned up. As you can see, you know, they have the pool maintenance, some landscaping pool here. This property sold for $539,000. Uh, it was VA, so they gave some credit back for that. Uh, and it turned out to be a really great investment for this couple. Uh, military who owned it before and military who's buying it now. So there's a lot of great opportunities. Are you thinking of buying any investment properties right now? Because this would have been a really great one. And then also, are you looking to maybe sell? So I know some friends out there may have some properties. They may be looking to transfer into purchasing other investment properties that may make them more money. So here's the thought. A lot of people say, oh, the market's so high, the market's so high. True. However, if you never get in, when are you going to wait? Are you going to wait for that falling knife? Or are you going to catch it when you can catch it now and start building equity into the property and start fixing it up and getting good rents for the property now and own it for the next 5, 10, 15, 20 years? So what's your strategy? Uh, I'd, be lo I'd love to have the opportunity to sit down and talk to you about investing into real estate or if you're looking for your first home or it's your 10th home or you're looking to sell right now because I think it's a great market with the low, low interest rates and still a shortage of inventory out there in extreme level. And that's why I'm prospecting. So my job is to get out there every single day. And I tell this to my wife all the time. I get up every day because I get to help at least one to two to three people change their lives. And by selling one property, it affects at least the lives of 26 individuals minimum and then their families. Uh, there's a statistic out on that. So my job is to help the economy strong, making sure that people win in the real estate market and in life. So if you know of anybody that wants the truth, because the people that I just sold this home for listed with their friend for four months and they were a friend so they didn't want to hurt the seller's feelings by telling them what the real price was and I came and I told them honestly they didn't like it however they go hey we've seen your track record you sold 32 homes last year you must be doing something right because the average agent sells three homes three homes that's it so that's living under the poverty line nevertheless it's active marketing it's getting up every single day and helping the clients win. So that's my uh, my little wrap here at 1791 Redwood South. I will go anywhere to help clients sell their property and even buy properties. Buying property is a little bit more of a specialty. Nevertheless, sometimes I use other agents with Pacific Sotheby's or if I know a good Mike Ferry agent in that area specifically, I definitely will refer them. So I appreciate the referrals and any questions out there, give me a call. It's Carlos Gutierrez. Hey, Tom, great to see you. You and John and Chris, love you, brother. I know you're in real estate in the uh, Inland Empire. If you're dealing with the same shortage of inventory, I know you do a lot on the uh, on the uh, property management side. Nevertheless, uh, we're dealing with it here in San Diego. So love to hear from you. Don't forget next Wednesday. 
Water Bar, we're going to be having our connecting event. It's all about connecting. And uh, next Wednesday from 4.30 to 8, I'm hosting it. You need to RSVP because we have limited space here. We've invited a lot of my great friends. So hit me back here or text me at 858-864-8741. Till then, hopefully uh, you're staying cool. I know at the coast it's going to burn off, but uh, this pool looks pretty good right now out here in beautiful Escondido. Okay, guys, we'll be seeing you shortly. Thank you.